all right guys today we are going to optimize the cpu performance of it especially for gaming purpose actually it will allow your cpu to perform at its full potential and there are no side effects the first thing we will do is create an ultra performance power option you can copy the command from the description and paste it into the powershell let's get started um one more thing it will more noticeable on older pc so if you are using the order PC, just let me know in the comment section and after applying this uh, configuration. The first thing you need to do here, just uh, copy the command from description and paste it in the power shell. So just type here the power shell first. Okay. All right. Let's go into the uh, edit power plan. Then here, when you click on the change advanced power settings, you will get here the high performance power saving and balanced you will not get the ultimate performance option um, for getting the ultimate performance option you need to just copy that command mentioned in the description and paste it in the powershell now we are typing here the power shell and then right click on it run as administrator once you launch the power shell by administratorly now simply we need to paste the command over here all right just control v and then hit enter that's it ultimate performance now just close it and then again go into the power options and then change advanced settings now here you will get another power options power option just like that all right just go over there process and power management now just copy all these settings if you have if you don't have any uh, any of option from here in your PC. So just let me know in the comment section. Now processor performance core parking should be on 100%. Processor idle demote threshold should be on 40. Then processor idle disable um, should be on enable. And maximum processor frequency idle promote threshold 60. Minimum processor state 100%. Processor performance core parking over utilization threshold should be on 60% and system cooling policy active and the maximum processor state should be on 100% and then hit apply. Okay. Now I have already done these settings just showing you. Now let's move on the next step which is more important for today's optimization. Go into the MS config. Just click on the windows type MS config. You will get here the system configuration. Just open it. Go into the boost then advanced options and then number of processors. Select here the maximum threads and hit OK. Hit apply and OK. Note it does not directly impact performance until you finish the entire process. Let's move on this step number three. Go into the performance monitor. So just click here. Type here the performance monitor once you open this now you will see here the data collector on the right side you will see user defined just double tap on it and then right click on it go into the new data collector set now type here cpu boosting you can type any name actually create manually we will go like advanced then click on next now performance counter click on next click on add now here we need to add a few things just select here the processor and expand it once you expand it, select here the maximum thresh, uh, maximum threads. Click on add over here. Now, one more thing we need to add from here, which is uh, thread count. Just select it and click on add. Once you add over here, now simply you need to click on OK and then click on finish. Once you have done this, you can also right click on it and click on start. Otherwise, just restart your PC and it will start automatically. You don't need to do any further thing with this. After doing this, just close it. Now, next, uh, by the way, it's by ring bell and I really appreciate it for these registry tweaks. These are amazing, guys. Uh, first, we will optimize the uh, CPU optimization. But before creating any uh, registry tweak, you need to make a backup. So for that, you can just go type here the registry editor, open it click on the file and then make sure click on the export and make a backup anywhere anyways i don't need to make any backup just click on ok ok and then disable power throttling click on yes ok game optimization click on yes ok now quick cpu setup just double tab on it click on next install it install install and then launch it 
might be there's a new update available but you don't need to update it anymore because we don't need anything from this now make sure it's like core parking on uh, index on 100% turbo boosting index on 100% and frequency scaling index on 100% I have already done these settings so it's just working pretty well but might be in your case uh, the frequency scaling should be on 40 or 60 so leave it on 100% turbo boost should be on 60% so leave it on 100% and then hit apply and close it after doing this just restart your pc and then let me know in the comment section let's drop your feedback related to this optimization see you in the next video till then just take yourself a la face bye bye